Get on to rock, get up to burn, stand with the pride, ever feel your desire. Hello and welcome to some more Pokemon Sword. You thought we were done with this game? No, they decided to make an expansion pass. Part one of the was the Isle of Armor. That DLC wasn't that good, but you know, it was nice to have an entirely new area to explore, I guess. The Crown Tundra is supposed to be better because you get to catch legendaries, so let's just go. Let's just jump into it. Laura's back again. Yeah, I'm here. Hi. Yeah, yeah, she's here. I'm talking to the dude now. I'm recording now. my own audio. She's recording her own oh, audio okay, because shoot. she's been so quiet, <laughs> apparently. I don't know. Look, you have your fan on in the background, okay? I, how am I supposed to work with that? How am I supposed to work with okay. that? <laughs> anyway, you have I'll a crown pass. Yeah. Would what? you like to go to... So yeah, let's go to Crown Tundra Station. Let's go. Choo choo, let's go. Choo choo. Uh, it's right under Galar? Dude, we could have just walked there. <laughs> yeah! It's right under Galar. What the fuck? Also, like, why is it snowy in the south? It usually is colder north. I mean, there is a south pole for a reason. Oh, okay. Anyway, this is the Crown yeah, Tundra. I should have a jacket, but you know what? Fuck it. <laughs> I got a leather jacket, but I should have gloves that cover my hands. I think we do get a more um excavation style outfit here. Come on, Dad! Lay off and quit following me already. <laughs> I don't want an orange. Oh, who's that? You gotta go on a Dynamax picture in the map. Oh, do you want to voice this character? Uh, sure. She looks like another waifu for you. Anyway. I mean, she looks a little on the younger side, uh, not gonna lie. I'm gonna go on a Dimax adventure in the Max Lantern. I don't need you breathing down my neck. I'm here to battle loads and loads of red Dynamax Pokemon. <laughs> don't you fret. I know somewhere- I know somewhere way more fun than that musty old place. Get ready for loads of holy time with your coolest dad ever. I'm a cool dad. <laughs> what a generous and totally unwanted offer. Pretty god to say no thanks. I don't know what voice I'm gonna do for this lady. <laughs> So I guess we're going to be talking Hello. to them. Oh, oh. Uh. Come on, Nia. Be, be reasonable. <laughs> we're getting ready to be ultra mega embarrassed. As I unleash the noble roar of a dad. I will make a dad punch. <laughs> God, I'll talk your hard pass on that, thanks. I don't know what voice I want to do for this lady. She has know. no <laughs> specific. Do a stereotypical a girl. teenage girl that's afraid her dad will embarrass her or whatever. He has a Dynamax man. Um, excuse me, hello. Yes, you, the girl over there or boy over there, depending on if your parents. The, the person over there. <laughs> Did you just assume my gender? My dad is stubborn as steel and he won't leave me alone. Does he use steel type Pokemon? Back me up, would you? That's nice, lady. I never knew my father. Anyway. Uh, wait, did you say yes or no? I said yes. Okay. Whatever. Whatever. Did you? Yes, I said yes. Okay. Brilliant. Have a great time with this geezer then. Now, hold on, lad. Can't say I approve of you button in blindly. Is he a pirate? <laughs> but if I just give you a trouncing, this young lady here ought to see reason. The name's... Peony? Pony? Peony. 
Peony? That's the that's the name of the flower. Huh, okay. Brace yourself, I'm pretty ferocious in battle. Are we doing this live? Yes, we're doing this live. <laughs> Challenge of the Pokemon trainer Peony. Okay. He's got Copper Raja. Okay, so he definitely type. does use steel types. He definitely uses steel types. <laughs> this is a bad day for you, dude. <laughs> Steel's tough as they come. The more hits it takes, the more of the mega determined something. It's Agron! Oh, I love Agron! <laughs> Too bad it's gonna fucking die. Oh shit! He lived! Oh, okay, he had a berry. Citrus berry. Ah, uh, that's sturdy. Stone Age? Damn, that might actually hurt. That hurt a lot. Holy shit. Yes. Oh, and the pale yeah. killed Shinra! Fuck! There we go. <laughs> Look at me taking a thrashing from a youngster like you. Hmm? My darling daughter's disappeared! Where have you gone, my sweet Nia? I want to say, are you sure sweet is the word? <laughs> but, sure, he's probably going to take offense that. to that. <laughs> Fuck it, I'll say it. I of did. course! My Nia is the sweetest, darlingest daughter a dad could ask for. I brought her out here so we could have a proper father-daughter trip. First one in ages. And now that we've got here, she grabs the first trainer she finds, makes him a decoy, and legs it. That's my dear Nia for you. That's just her backward way of showing her papa she loves him. <laughs> Must be. That's the type of girl she is. Ultra mega charming, isn't it? Still, without her, I can't start this adventure of legendary spots I planned for us. She mentioned wanting to have a gander at some place called the Max Lair, didn't she? Sounds to me like she wants good old papa to chase after her. Well, she needn't worry. I'm not one for wasting time. Which means it's time I got a move on. Cheers for a fine battle. I'll be seeing you then, lad. Take care of those strong Pokemon of yours. Okay. okay. Well. The Crown Here's Tundra. Did he even heal my Pokemon? He probably didn't. He didn't. That ass. Is he a Cryogonal? Oh. That Pokemon made it back, of course. <laughs> There's no pretty Oh. Okay. Alright, let's see the tracks. Okay. Move towards yeah. it. So there they are. These are exactly what I was looking for. I knew my hypothesis was spot on. Hmm? Wait, TJ? What are you she doing in a place be, like this? She should be wearing something warmer. That crop top is not going to do it, girl. <laughs> right. I'm exploring. Are you, are you having me on? This freezing place? Probably the kind of local I'd pick... The locale I'd pick to go exploring if, I, if it were up to me. Yet you're still here. But here I am, stuck in the crown tundra, trying to learn more about a group of Pokemon. There are some Pokemon that prefer places where there are no people, you see? Pokemon that choose to live in isolation. Like Absol. Absol hates people! <laughs> the Crown Tundra here is just a place for that sort of Pokemon. If my theory is correct, then I think a certain tree of legendary Pokemon could be lurking somewhere in these lands. I'm sure my theory is not I wrong. What it is. If you want some proof, then look there. See those Wolverines? Those are not. Any of the bird's footprints. Those Iron. do not look like bird's footprints. Evidence of the Iron Will Pokemon. That's 2% of the data you need to track it. Oh, are they talking about that weird tall deer looking thing? Oh. <laughs> My theory is that the legendary Iron Will Pokemon. I don't care about the bulb. <laughs> he looks Pokemon like a bulb. And grassland Pokemon are all somewhere out here in the Crown Tundra. And there's evidence like this scattered all over the place that'll lead us to them. 
if we could find more evidence and collect 100% of the data needed to track these legendary Pokemon, then I bet we could use my Pokemon Viner to figure out what habitats they're living in. This place is wicked cold and it's putting me in hibernation mode. You plan to stick around here for a while, TJ? Think you could try and spot more evidence like this and report it to me when you find it? I'll reward you for hard for your- this isn't, this isn't gonna be another Zygarde situation, is it? I'll waiting. be waiting in that house there so I can stay warm and cozy and maybe feel my fingers still <laughs> so that I can grip pen and write, of course, since I'll be working so hard on my research. Don't pawn your research I'm just off gonna on drink me. Coffee. You're, you're gonna sick me with the field work for a Pokemon that I don't even want to catch? That's fucked up, Sonya. That's fucked up. Please, sir, I can't let you. Oh, I think you can. My precious daughter's in there and I'm going in after her. I understand, sir, but... But what? I'm here to have an adventure. And if I want to kick it off right now, I simply can't allow it, sir. <laughs> oh, there you are, lad. So you've come after all, have you? Something the matter? Nothing's alright, and everything's the matter. This ultra-mega num... Numpty? Of a scientist <laughs> insists on getting in my way. Numpty of a... I beg your pardon, sir. I beg your beg pardon. Your pardon. <laughs> if you'd be so good as to simply listen, I could let you through. Dynamax adventures are quite fraught with peril, I'm afraid, and uh, I've got no patience for standing here listening to you rattle off the fine print. We're just going around in circles. You seem to know this gentleman. Would you simply listen to my explanation? I if know. so. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of just want to play. <laughs> If so, I could allow the two of you to enter as a pair. Ha, ah, now you're talking. Go on then. Let's hear what the good lady's got to say. Oh, now you want to listen. And then we'll go find my little Nia together. Right? Right? The max lair is a labyrinthine underground cave room where rare Pokemon dwell. The likes of which. Labyrinth. Labyrinthine? Is that how you say it? That's the first time I've ever seen that word. <laughs> I guess. The likes of which are not found in the Galar region. So yeah, Dynamax Adventure, form a team of four trainers and set off to explore the mysterious Max Lair. See if you can find the legendary Pokemon that await you in the deepest part of this unusual den. I like how the first picture they show is Giratina. They know what I want. They know what I want too. To take part in the Dynamax Adventure, you must borrow a single Pokemon to accompany you. Get things started by having each trainer select the Pokemon they will take with them on their adventure. As you explore this thing, you'll come borrow? to avoid the risk of Galar okay. particle overexposure, which can cause your own dear Pokemon to lose control. We have prepared Pokemon for you that are resistant to the particle effects. Okay, so we can't use our own Pokemon. Sorry, Laura. Use it makes you lose control. Right, right. I follow you. You're saying you don't want Galar to lose control, oh, so the Pokemon rent some particles, and we might see if you're overexposure. That was stunningly incorrect, sir. <laughs> Olympin! Olympin! You'll be my candle shoe! <laughs> I want my sixth and final sandal. <laughs> I want to break free from your life. Oh my gosh, there's another sandal lore. I want. I want you. I want you. I'm gonna get you! <laughs> I want another one! We have so many in here! I love Shandalu! I got another Shandalur. I will name it a fuzz bucket. <laughs> so many lampants! There are so many! I can't adopt them all, I'm sorry. I have to move. I have to go. There are so many. Oh, a Trevenant. There's so many uh, ghost type Pokemon. And a freaking Dragapult! Why are they all here? <laughs> this is. This game knows I like ghosts! 